And welcome back to another video from IFA 2009. We're still with George Mead. We're on the LG stand. Now, George, this is not a product coming to market. It's more of a showcase, but we're looking at OLED and I've got to say, it looks fantastic. It does look absolutely stunning, doesn't it? In all its glory, just three millimetres in terms of depth, a power consumption of just 30 watts. It really is the cutting edge of technology. But like you say, at the moment it's a prototype for us. But in November, the products will be launched in the Korea market. And in next year, it will come to the UK. So we're really excited about bringing people the technology of, of OLED. The power consumption benefits the ultra-wide viewing angle. Um, but obviously 15 inches at moments, but we are developing larger screen sizes because we know that people do desire for this ultimate in technology on television. And do you think this is definitely going to be a, an early adopter type technology? It's, it's going to be expensive, isn't it? It's going to be an expensive product because of the amount of research and development that's required to bring this technology to life. Um, it, I think you're 100% right in terms of an early adopter, real at the high end that wants, that wants something first before anyone else will absolutely seek out the, the OLED solution. But saying that it's only 15 inches at the start, it is going to be an expensive solution. But for someone who really does want the benefits of that ultra-wide viewing angle with a depth of just three millimeters and to get the stunning picture quality that OLED does offer, as well as having a power consumption that's going to beat anything in terms of LCD, LED or plasma at the same screen sizes, it's something that we need to maintain that level of investment to bring it out in larger screen sizes and being able to, to then bring that price point down to enable us to become more mass market with the solution. And I guess it's a difficult time at the moment to be releasing this kind of, kind of technology. Lots of other manufacturers putting it on the back burner because of the recession. Is that affecting your development or, or not? It's the time for LG to step up to the plate. We believe that within the recession there's a majority of consumers, or a, a portion of consumers I should say, that are actually staying in and enjoying entertainment within the home spending less money on going to expensive restaurants. So we believe that at the moment, these type of technology will, always, will polarize the market. People at the top end will look and seek out this type of technology. People at the bottom end of the market will look at just a, at a price point or a technology that they want, but always at a price point. So we still believe that that high end consumers will still look to desire this type of technology. So we need to maintain that investment. So in the next couple of years, when we do come out of a recession, we're already there at the forefront of the consumer's minds. OK, well, that's OLED technology. Uh, we've still got lots to see, so George is going to take us around the stand. Come back and see us again.